Hello Leo, I hope you're all doing well. Thank you for all your likes, shares and subscribes and welcome to the channel. Now this is a general reading, it might not resonate with everyone. If it doesn't, there's a playlist on my channel for November if you want to look at that Leo one. Or you could look at their moon and rising sign and that might give you a better idea of what's going on around you. Oops, it is it. I'm wanting one here. There we go. Four of air. So this is the four of swords here. Equivalent to the four of swords. Time to rest or take a vacation. Allow more time before making a decision. Meditation may provide answers. Now, not everybody meditates. Uh, you could go for a walk, do something that quietens you down and puts you at peace with yourself. But this here is about reviewing things, um, taking time to, about how you're going to go forward. It could be healing, rejuvenation. It could be healing from an illness here, or you could be pampering yourself. You might need to pamper yourself a wee bit. Be good to yourself here. Listen deeply. So this is about listening to your intuition, connecting them with your gut voice here, your soul voice, whatever it is you call it. It's about how you're feeling, sensing and what you're seeing around you. Your intuition never lets you down. So listen to your intuition here because it will be correct. It keeps you on the right path. And ask and ask and receive. Now you can ask for help from the angels, ask for help from anyone. Spirit doesn't intervene or support you unless you ask for their help. So it might be that you're needing to review things here. Listen to your intuition if you're having to make any kind of decisions to go forward. And Spirit is around to help if you want that support. Now, there's other support from people as well. There's people in the material earth we can ask for help from and support. It's not asking for help is not a weakness. Uh, you might have to gain advice. Anything like you might want to talk things through if you're reviewing things. So there's support around if you want it here, Leo. We have got the Wheel of Fortune, Judgment card, Sun card, the beautiful Temperance here, the Justice card, which is the central energy, the Nine of Swords, the Seven of Pentacles, beautiful Two of Pentacles, and the King of Cups. Now, we have got here the anxiety card. Now, this could be different degrees of this for everybody. There could be sleepless nights, or there could be people that are, things are just weighing heavy on your mind. What Spirit's saying is here, it's time to reflect and review things. You're going to have to make a judgment call. It's time to leave this energy behind. Listen to your intuition here about whatever it is you're going through. Now, this could be in any area of your life. It could be with your work life, your finances, your relationships, or your uh, environments. And what's people's uh, spirit saying here, it's time to rest and take time out. You might want to go on a holiday, it's suggesting here. And you might want to meditate or take a walk somewhere. But it's allowing time to reflect and review on things. Because you're going to have to make a judgment call here. And you're going to have to weigh things up and decide how to bring better balance to your life. It's time to be doing this. Now, there's support around you if you want it. That's what Spirit's saying. You can involve other people, ask for support, or you can ask the angels for support. But this is about, you could be making a head over heels decision in any area of your life. And it's about bringing better balance. So you're going to have to make a judgment call here. There's choices needing to be made. Take time to reflect on this. This is somebody who's been through battle, but you've gained knowledge. Reflect on what you've learned here to help with your judgment calls. Now, there could be a person from your past coming back or a deja vu type situation coming back round. Something you feel you've dealt with before that's very similar. What Spirit's saying here is use the knowledge you've gained from past experiences to help, along with your intuition, to help with your decision making here. But there's a decision that's definitely going to have to be made. And this decision will take you away from the anxiety and it will bring better balance in. So judgment calls here. Now, this is about nurturing things. It's about taking time once you've made your judgment, brought the balance back, be prepared to nurture things and take patience with whatever it is you're involving yourself with. Now, like I say, it could be a financial plan, a savings plan. It could be investing in a property. You're going to have to wait for the profits to grow. Investing in a relationship, uh, in your work environment, whatever it may be for you. If you're prepared to have patience and grow and nurture these situations, 
through time you will see growth and abundance will come in. So it's good judgment calls here are needed, most definitely, because this is about you going towards your happiness. Now, you're going to come into this very well-balanced energy, emotionally stable place, rather than being in this anxiety-type state. So this could be you being at one with things, being patient. You've made your decision. You're patient. You're level-headed. You're feeling content. There's a certain amount of emotional stability around you. Now, this could also be somebody coming in that's very loving and caring, that's supportive. Um, and they could support you with your decisions, or they might help you nurture things. This could also be an opportunity for love, a Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio energy coming in. And you're weighing that up and you're patient and you're growing that and you're working at that and you'll see the benefits that are going to happen for you. Now, this is about here as well. If we rest and rejuvenate and we make this decision, we're suddenly going to move forward very quickly. The Wheel of Fortune is working in your favour and the universe is supporting you here. So there could be sudden movement forward after time of reflection, after you weigh things up and you make this judgment call. The universe is going to support you go forward uh, because the Wheel of Fortune is moving in your favour and there's luck on your side here. So take time out to decide how you want to go forward. Um, don't rush things by any means, because what's going to happen here is karmic justice is going to come into play. And karmic justice is the universe rewarding you. Things are going to start to fall into place. Now, this could also be a legal situation that goes in your favour that helps you move forward. And suddenly you've been waiting on this outcome. The decision is made. You can start to weigh things up now and you start to go towards greater growth. And you know where to invest your time and your energies. And it's going to bring a lot of happiness to you in that sense. But this karmic justice that's coming in or this judgment going in your favour, no matter what it may be, is going to bring beautiful balance to your life after there's been anxiety and uh, things weighing heavy on your mind. So you're going to come into great balance. Yeah, it's fire and water balanced out. It's a major arcana card. This only comes in after times of challenges. Definitely. But there's going to be things working out for you. Things will balance themselves out and there'll be greater harmony that will come into your life through weighing things up and going forward. And there's going to be a lot of happiness as well, Leo, that's going to come in here. The planets are aligning. Spirit is supporting you. You're being rewarded for your choices, your efforts here, your patience. Everything is going to fall into place here and there's going to be great happiness in the future. Now, I'm just going to quickly clarify this Two of Pentacles energy. See the outcome of this decision. Yeah. This decision is designed, do not battle with yourself. Do not listen to other people here. Don't doubt yourself when you're making these decisions. You can bring the balance back. You will make the right judgment calls. This here is about antagonistic energy within yourself, not believing in yourself, or it could be competition within your environment. It could be people saying, are you sure you want to do this? It's about you doing what's right for you. And the fires are changed. So this decision you're making, this head over heels decision that you're making is going to bring the change in that's needed here. And it's going to bring great stability to you, your family, your soul tribe. If it's a relationship that you're working on here, it could lead to marriage. It could lead to family life. So beautiful uh, uh, stability for your future. If it's not your family, whoever you consider to be family. And this is somebody sitting back after putting the efforts in, making good decisions and judgment calls, being patient and sitting back now through nurturing things and enjoying the fruits of your labour. So anything you put your efforts into here is going to grow and prosper. You're going to have financial stability. You're going to have uh, somebody who's sitting back. You could become a boss here. You could become promoted um, because you've been patient and you've worked hard at things. You could be creating great stability. Uh, in your home life, there could be marriage, like I say, uh, because you've done the work. And this is important. You've done the work here and you're benefiting from the efforts that you're putting in. The justice card is here. The universe will reward you. We've got signs. Your past loved ones are never far away. Notice the signs they send you. Now, these sign symbols are synchronicities, I always say. It could be repeating music, songs you're hearing, uh, cats that cross your path, master numbers, 22, 33, 44, all these types of repeating things. The spirit is trying to connect in with you. Master numbers have meanings, so please look them up. It's spirit trying to give you another message. Home. 
it's time to renovate or change something in your home environment or move home. And it might be the case for some of you. I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.